In this webcam video I'm going to be talking about setting up the V shape between the first finger and the thumb in the right hand. And this is on Dad Dad Tuning and the thumb is on the fourth string and the first finger is on the first string. So what the tendency is, is for players to have their wrist down low and try and scrunch everything in. So the first thing we need is the wrist up and we want just the thumb and the fingers touching the, the fourth string and the first string. So here's a way to think about that. Is just put your hand flat and on the fingertips, sorry, put your hand, fingers on the fingertips, thumb next to it, and leave your hand where it is and just move your thumb out as far as it'll go. Then just bring your thumb back in. Same again. So the whole idea is that the fingers stay still and the thumb moves. So that's awareness number one. And that's you can do that on the kitchen table anywhere. And see how the wrist is up. And it's actually quite hard to do that with the wrist down, so that's a good way to train your wrist. The opposite of that's also the case. So slip your fingers up, thumb there, and just leave your thumb there and let your fingers move out. Okay, so there's a bit of wrist work there, but again, it's really hard to do with a low wrist, and so you need to lift your hand up. Okay, so what we're after when the thumb and the wrist is, we want that kind of space, and that's what I call the V. There's a V right in there between the thumb and the first finger, as you can see. So we want that, and that's not particularly natural for a new hand to do. So we need the hand to pose this on the table, we'll do, and just get that sense of keep the thumb still and move the fingers, or keep the fingers still and move the thumb, or move them both. Okay, so it's all building up that awareness. Now we come on to the guitar, and we're just lightly touching the first string with our first finger, and the thumb on the fourth finger. And we don't want the thumb to bend, we want the thumb to be quite straight, like a hitchhiker thumb. And all we want to do is sit here and pose and hold that, just hold that shape for a minute or so. Now I've got this angle for the camera, I'm going to put it back on the knee so we can see how, how it looks like there. Okay. And that's the kind of shape we're after. And um, you need to pose that or get your child to pose it and that's all it means just posing it relaxing no pressure just posing just getting their muscles used to that gap which muscles particularly the little muscles then when you've posed it what will the next then do is just let both the thumb and the finger come in together and just touch the next string then go back open out and then just very lightly brush over that string and touch the next one. And back and touch. Then roll over and touch. And back. And the important thing is, is that we're keeping the V and we're going really, really slow with no tension. So we're not after sound here. We're after relaxation and form. You can also do this on the table. Just doing this. Just moving very slightly towards each other, very slightly, because most of the energy is in getting the muscle started, okay, and getting the hand used to that. So that ends this lesson about setting up the right hand, the thumb and the first finger, and relaxing their way across a couple of strings. And that ends this webcam lesson.